This procedure generates recombinant Rift Valley fever virus, MP12 strain, encoding mutated NSs by reverse genetics, and aims to characterize the phenotypes for vaccine development. First, using a transfection system in BHK T7-9 cells, which stably express T7 RNA polymerase, recover recombinant MP12 strain mutants. Then, amplify the recovered recombinant MP12 strain mutant in Vero E6 cells, and titrate the amplified MP12 mutants by plaque assay. The final step of the procedure is to screen for the lack of interferon alpha or beta suppression by mutant NS proteins. Ultimately, results can facilitate the preparation of candidate live attenuated vaccine for Rift Valley fever through a reverse genetics system. The main advantage of this technique over existing method like randomly introducing mutations into viral genome by using chemical mutagen or serial passage is the ability to introduce designed attenuation mutation into viral genome by using reverse genetic system. This method can help address key questions in the field of Rift Valley fever vaccines, such as the significance of the major virulence factor NSS and the immunogenicity of vaccine candidates. Generally, individuals new to this method will struggle because Rift Valley fever virus, like an NSS, form target plugs, and visualization of plug required an optimized technique. Visual demonstration of this method is critical as the viral recovery and titration steps are difficult to learn because step-by-step -step protocol for this method has not been reported.